There was a cheap indoor garage sale that started at 8 o'clock and I got there at 7 a.m. I made sure I was one of the first in the line, and I was, because I knew I was going to find some really good stuff to resell. What's poppin' people is your host Cam, and if you are one of the new people to the channel, welcome. You're about to see my full-time job in effect. I go to garage sales and yard sales, buy stuff for very cheap, and then put it on eBay and sell it online for a profit. And it's pretty fun. So that's enough talking. Let's go ahead and hop right into this video to show you guys what we found at this indoor garage sale. It was pretty good. Okay, um, yeah, that can work, yeah. What did you need? Can. Or you want to throw that stuff in here? What if we do this? Yeah, that'll be easier for you. Much easier than yours. These are awesome shoes, aren't they? Yeah, no, I like the deals too. Hardly really never good. used. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Thank you. I think I'm ready. Okay, and this is Cam. That's your box right now. Yeah, okay. Okay, cool. Yeah. I'll pull it over here for now. Yeah. Told it already? Oh, okay, okay, okay. Well, yeah, when people bring it out. We... That's fine. Um, What's it at right now? You're at 25. Oh, okay, then. Yeah, that's fine. I'll just throw it all. We're good then. You're getting that stuff too? Yeah, I think. I'm not sure I'm going to grab. Buying in three more shirts. You're just going to take the box? Or are you going to throw it all in the bag? Um, yeah, I, I'll, I'll throw it all in the bag. That can work. Thank you. How are you doing? We got your total. It comes to 31. Awesome. Thank you for coming. How did you hear about us?
All right, guys, I'm going to go ahead and show you what we found at that church rummage sale. Here is a vintage polo Ralph Lauren. Look at the tag. Definitely a different looking tag. Just a button down shirt. That's probably going to return me maybe like 20 bucks. We also have a Columbia size XL sleeveless vest fleece, I guess is what they would say it. And yeah, it's a full zip. So good size as well. So I'm sure that's going to return me maybe like 20, 25 dollars. Now this piece right here is a Lauren Ralph Lauren. I want to say it's a trench raincoat. And I haven't seen exact comps on it yet, but I'm sure I can still probably get over $50 to $60 for that one piece. This one over here is a 5.11 Tactical Series long sleeve button down shirt. And I believe it is a 2XL, so good size as well. And that's going to sell for probably around $20 to $25. Now over here coming to the shoes, this is kind of what we got. And I was just picking up things as I went. Didn't even look them out. This is the best pair right here though. These are Doc Martens there, the Rohan series. And I looked these ones up. I think I could probably get around $40 for those. And we just have some basic Crocs, guys. I think shoes were like $2 a piece or something like that. So once I clean these up, that's an easy $15 right there. Another pair of Crocs sandals right here. That's an easy $15. Bucks. And then some more Crocs slip-ons. Like Crocs usually return me $15 to $20. These ones might be a little more because they're a bigger size, but they're bread and butter. We also have a pair of Nikes right here. These are going to sell for maybe around $20, $25. Just depends because this is like a smaller size. So maybe I'll get around there. We have these New Balances right here. 860 V8s. I haven't looked these up. So I don't know. Maybe like $20 there. And more pair of New Balances here. And they have a price tag in here of like $40. So I don't know. I just picked them up because they're in really, really good shape. And why not for $2? We also picked up some of these shirts in here, just a basic Nike polo shirt, nothing crazy. It's like $10, $15. We also have a Tabasco polo shirt. Be on the lookout for these Tabasco shirts. They do sell pretty well. I think I could probably get like 15 and 20 for that as well. And then we have a Columbia PFG long sleeve shirt size XL, I believe, so a good size. Other than that, I think we scored pretty well at the sale considering we only paid, what, $31, I think? So I'll take it. Once again, I found another church rummage sale and of course the prices were unbelievable. Most of the brands and items I picked up at this sale, I kind of knew was already going to sell on eBay. For example, I found those Doc Martens. I already sold them for $40 and I believe I got them for like three bucks guys. $3 in the 40. You cannot beat that. It was definitely worth it to get up a little early on this day to get to that sale because I knew all the good stuff was going to be there and I ended up getting it all. You can also find these type of sales by researching them on Facebook Marketplace, Craigslist, and also an app called Yard Sale Finder app. Usually they always post kind of what the sale is going to be about and then what day obviously it's going to be. So just do your research beforehand and you'll find them. Trust me.